What was the most powerful weapon of World War II? The atom bomb? The B-29? What if I told you it was probably this? A miracle drug called penicillin. Yesterday my ears started hurting after I returned from travel and it struck me how lucky I am to live in a world where I can just take a pill and the pain stops. For most of human history, soldiers were more likely to die from infection or illness than battle wounds. During World War II, one in 10 American soldiers had some kind of venereal disease. And the only treatment was mercury, which was of questionable efficacy. And before penicillin, people died of all sorts of things that would be preventable today. Now, there were sulfa drugs that helped prevent infection, but nothing even came close to the power of penicillin. Penicillin allowed sick and infected soldiers to get back into the fight faster. It was a force multiplier. It allowed you to do more with the same amount of troops. Penicillin was extracted from a certain kind of mold, discovered in 1928 by Oxford scientist Alexander Fleming. Although it took years of overcoming technical problems for his team to create a usable drug. And its production was so important, its funding was second only to the atom bomb. 